Greetings, this is Lord Virgilus, and I'd like to welcome you to a new run I'm going to be doing. This is going to be on the PlayStation by good old Squaresoft. And it's, uh, I was actually thinking about what to do. Do I want to do a long game or a short game? I'm already currently doing an RPG, so I don't really want to do any more RPG. So let's just do a kind of action RPG. This is Threads of Fate. And we're starting a new game. And we'll turn vibration on. And I'll choose my character. So this is about a guy named Rude. And a girl named Mint. So we're gonna start with Rude's story. It's a dual story. Oh it's the, yeah, I did say Fred's with it. Did I? Yeah, I think I did. Yes. So we start with a tadpole. And little tadpoles. Wee 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 wee. I don't know, the story behind this one I'm really just kind of going with that I actually played a demo of this on, I think, bonus discs of some, this is like the summer of Square, and this is literally, it's like 90, no, was it 99 to 2000, and I call it the pretty much the, the Summer of Square, because they came out with some really good shit during that time, I have to say, really good. Like, really good. And shit has some good, good stuff. And I did this one as a demo, I can't remember where it is. What was it? I can't remember what demo it was. On what disc it was. It wasn't the set of years. It wasn't with... Anyway, nevertheless, it was one of the preview discs, and it was only like the first stage, and it got me hooked. And I'm like, this this thing is going to be freaking insane. And then I play it, and then I pass it in the first day. <laughs> I didn't I didn't think it would be that easy to actually pass. So enough about my story. Let's go with the story of this. So this is Rude and Claire. Claire. I don't really think Claire is, is... It's not a sister. It's not really a girlfriend. It's... It might be a girlfriend, I'm not totally sure. But... There's obviously no voice acting in this. And... It's mainly just... It starts off kind of weird. It's If anything, it's like Resident Evil 2. And that's really weird comparing it to that. But it is like that because the two stories connect each other. And if you play one story before the other, it has slight changes, and then there's the ultimate, you know, ending at the end. Where if you pass both of them, they. And this doesn't have analog stick. Oh, it doesn't have analog stick. Analog control? Wow, I haven't played this in ages. It's a build ready soon. Wow, okay. Oh, I'm so hungry. Gotta love that. PlayStation polygons. I don't know, like, I have to say Square really got some good hits back in, like... Like, I think it's 99 to 2000. Because they actually... Or even 98 and 99, 2000, around that, around that time. And that's actually kind of interesting, because... That's when I got into like pretty much the my PlayStation era type thing. That's where I kind of just said I do have to say that 64 wasn't really cutting it for me, so I was like, okay, um, to basically put it <laughs> in Claire thing, Claire thing. Um, I'm really embarrassed. Is that it? It's basically Square left Nintendo. There's the whole thing. You can look it up. Um, and I'm like, okay, Square is obviously not going to stay with Nintendo. I'm going to go where Square is going, which is Sony. So I went to there, and I'm really glad I kind of did because I played a lot of awesome RPGs, and awesome games on PlayStation. Which I actually never thought I actually would be playing anything other than Nintendo. 
Even though I did like play some Sega at the time. So basically we got Rude looking for something that he heard outside. And then we got some dude with white hair and a giant glove. Giant claw. Now who the who's this white haired guy supposed to be? And well Basically there's not too much of a story and I don't really want to ruin the story. It pretty much unfolds very well. So pretty much what you see is pretty much what you you get at the at the beginning of the game. Because when I actually first played it, I had no idea what, what the hell what the hell story was for this game, but it really drawed me in. And well, that's what it is. Like, who is this guy with the big hand and the white hair, and who is this girl that Root seems to care about a lot? And what the hell happened here? Because they don't really show you what happened here, but she is lost in some way. And I just spoil it there, but anyway. And the relic. And for some reason I really thought the relic would actually be translated in from the the demo version, but it's the relic. It's called the relic until pretty much you know what the relic is, which I'm not gonna spoil what that is. And there's like little hints here and there of other things. Oh, these guys. I swear the comic relief of the game. <laughs> Smokey and we'll see that guy. Blood, blood and smoky eyes. Legendary treasure. Serious. <laughs> oh, yes. You got to say, even though it sounds like a very long game, it's not really. It's, it's the first time I did it. The I beat Rude starting within like a couple hours, so and I wasn't. You don't really need to necessarily like. There's levels in this, somewhat. I think yes. Don't really need to know what. What is this? Oh. Oh, <laughs> what the hell is this? I'm kind of just re redoing this game also because I haven't played it in like ages. Maybe I should have done like some practice. Should have maybe I should have done some practice, but no. What the heck was that? What the heck was that? Yeah, I just remember like it looks so familiar. I've been here before. I like to say Corneria, but it's not. It's Davis, yes. Davis. I know, this kind of reminds me of like. You know, type of style. Obviously, it reminds me of like 64, but it's not really 64. Probably could have been a 64 game, but yeah. All right, so we're gonna start our adventure. So we're in the forest. Hmm. We should go and see. Now there is a lot of things I can jump. I can jump on blocks or boxes. Now there is treasure around here. Just I don't know exactly where. That is the question. Where is this treasure? Treasure, 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 treasure. Because I do have to say this, it kind of follows a base, like thing you go out in kind of like stages, and you pretty much come back to this town. This is your main town. Actually, if anything, it reminds me of Wanders from News Three. Just not side scrolling. Well, the Super Nintendo. I guess I don't get any treasure here. Okay, up here. 
The music's okay in this. It's not exactly the best. What should I do? Well, I'm going to explore the village first. Because that's what you do. What is it? Oh, I oh, didn't actually get to see that. No! Okay, we're closer to the other one now. Yes. Okay. Uh huh. That's a long time, yes. Okay. Okay, so we're going over here, and I don't think we're going to run into the person that's here right now. But we are going to definitely have to come back here a lot later on. That's a cool ride, actually. That's a sweet ride. Oh, hey, what's going on, dude? You don't live here, do you? That's it? Well, screw you, buddy. Alright. Now, I'm playing Rude's story first, because you can get, get a sense of... You know, to be in... Mint's story is a lot more funnier. And if you see that little icon in the in the corner on the right, you can actually rotate it. Rotate the camera. Why? I have no clue. You don't really it's not really any benefits of rotating the camera. Who can I register? Register. I think this is saving. Yes it is. It's efficient blocks, but I'm not gonna worry about saving right now. Well trust me that you don't really need to save too much. But I will find a that's how you get to your stages, but we're not going to go there yet. Um, let's talk to some older people. Who? Hoodlums? Ah, yes, hoodlums. I think I might know who you're talking about. It's Markham. Markham, yes, Markham, yes. Interesting, Markham, yes. You have a weird spelling of your name, but anyway. Or maybe where I mark him that I'm thinking of. I spelt it weirdly also. Now, I don't know, that's the game really kind of focuses on not too many characters, I have to say. Okay. Um, that's a lot of money. I guess this is our menu screen, we have our status. HPMB, your strength, your bonuses is in the pretty much the plus. Whatever's after the plus is basically your bonus. Bonus. You got your money, your time, how much time it is, and then monsters, which I'll deal with. I'll pretty much say later what it is. You monsters, I'll deal with those later. And you got coins. Coins. What are coins for? It's not money, but it's a different thing. But I can't remember what it is. And your configurations, basically, vibrations on, camera, whatever, so forth. Yeah, that's all I need, and select doesn't do anything. But, that's pretty much, I wish I really, you can use, the, I really wish you could use the analog stick, but, nope. Can I go in here? Fantastic. Okay, fair enough. You didn't have to shout at me. God. Okay, in the back alley. There you go. I got a coin. Um, silver coin. Not too sure if there's a little saying that goes over his head or not that indicates that he needs to have the coin or not. I just spam the button basically to see if there's anything around. Oh wow. You're you're a creepy old man, aren't you? Uh, I'll take a root beer. Well, that's the thing. You, you, if you talk to people multiple times, sometimes they say different things. Right. 25% time. By any time. 
Well, you're the you're the pretty little thing that this this dirty old man's talking about. What you and the oh okay. I'm not going to. Okay, you're Hobbs. Okay. Care of items. Okay. Alrighty. Rod, okay. Interesting. I guess we'll find about that later on. And oh there's Hobbs, yeah, come back later, Hobbs. Yes, I guess that's where I can't rotate and I don't know why I'm trying to rotate the camera even though I can't. God knows what I actually did. But uh I talked to you, 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 and we'll deal with the I guess here, up here. Up here. And I don't know if I'm going to actually I don't know how I'm gonna split this up. This is a church. Or gospel tiny yes, church, yeah. Doyle. Yes, Doyle. Um not really. I think this may be a way to save or something. I had, I'm probably gonna do a little bit more reading on for the second part. But I'm just gonna keep on going. So we're gonna leave and we're going to I want to say Cornier, but it's not. It's car. <laughs>